Thank you. It made national news. A 26 year old cold case solved involving a Tucson woman who lived in Los Angeles. The suspect who was arrested and convicted hiding in plain sight. It's a Dateline special tonight on News 4 Tucson and Lupita Murillo has a preview. They say the wheels of justice turn slowly and for the family of Sherry Rasmussen, it would be nearly three decades before her killer would be brought to justice. Rasmussen, a newlywed, was only 29 years old when she was murdered. She was found with her face bashed. She was beaten and had been shot three times. She also had her arm bitten. In 1986, police were convinced it was a burglary gone wrong. Her father, a retired dentist here in town, disagreed with that theory and told detectives who he believed had killed his daughter. Decades later, another detective proved him right. Josh Mankiewicz reports. I sat up and screamed, bed. February 1986. Sherry Rasmussen's last minutes were spent in a brutal and bloody fight for her life. It only came to an end when Sherry Rasmussen was shot. There were some stereo components that had been removed from an entertainment center. There was a drawer that was pulled off from a table in between two sitting chairs. And Sherry's purse and car were missing. They walked in and they saw what appeared to be a burglary, and so that's what they ran with. The detectives kept looking for the burglars, but they didn't find them. The mystery of what happened to Sherry Rasmussen would take more than two decades to solve until another detective picked it up and found the key that unlocked a mystery. Never in my life did I think this would happen. Be sure to watch Dateline tonight and don't watch alone. Lupita Murillo, News for Tucson.